guys welcome back to another video i hope you're all well i hope you're all having a fabulous week if you can hear the whole house shattering then it's because my brother has decided to go and play basketball in the garden and the hoops attached to the house so the whole house when he fucking throws it is going blah. so yeah please just ignore that so today i have got a miss path haul for you guys i asked on my instagram like i think it was like last week what you guys kind of wanted to see if there was any particular brand and miss path was everywhere everyone wanted to see zara haul primark haul which i've just filmed miss pap haul so we're having a bit of a content day and i've got the goods i did a huge order on um miss pap and i kind of went with the vision of getting pieces that you can wear in pub gardens that you're not going to be freezing in like i've seen quite a lot of videos of like april 12 pub outfits and you're going to be freezing now i've got some good jackets some good like I, like just items that you can really like layer with because being realistic it's april and this is england like you cannot sit in a mini dress it's just not it's just not gonna happen so i've picked up some really nice wearable pieces that you can wear to the pub garden shopping eight for meals just some like, really good like wardrobe staples that you can really wear like all year round so the first thing that i picked up was this really cute like beige nude bomber so it's like a satin bomber i liked it i thought it was a bit different it's got la on and it's also got ruched on the sleeves now i wore this in my come to primark video and like come shop with me so you guys will definitely have seen it i got loads of messages on instagram asking where it's from when i posted it so i it says los angeles down this side that arm is plain but i got this in a size 10 and it is big but i pulled the tag off before i kind of realized how big it was so i definitely would want this in probably like a size 8 maybe a 6 so don't oversize like me but it's got two pockets they were stitched but i just ripped the stitching out because i love a pocket i don't get why they make pockets and stitch them off everything will be here with the prices it's just really big really cute i thought this like threw on with like jeans i wore it with a cat suit but i think even like with a t-shirt dress i threw it on quickly with a white t-shirt dress yesterday and it looked really cute with like little mini dresses but like a bomber is a perfect addition and it's like a really nice jacket that looks beautiful but also will keep you warm and like really snuggly so very happy with that now i did try and do these kind of this haul as kind of outfits so my vision for that bomber was to wear it with this really cute like white tank now i don't know if you can see but like it's a really nice ribbed can we talk about the nails for one second by the way <sighs> they're so beautiful so yeah really cute it's got like a nice undercut here so you'll have a, like a little bit of side boob. It's got this really like thick band. So like you're definitely going to be supported. But it's like bracer back vibes. Just a really simple tank. But I thought that could look really nice under the bomber. And then I paired it with some light blue jeans. Now I don't know if any of these jeans are going to fit. That's really the problem. So if these jeans don't fit. I'll obviously tell you guys in the try and fit. But I'll just pair that out. I would just pair that out with like another pair of blue jeans. So I picked these ones up. So I thought they were really cool and a little bit different. So they're just like, from the top, they look like quite a simple blue jean. They've got like a nice seam running through, which is like stitched. And then they've got zips on the bottom, which I thought was gorgeous. So like, if you did want to wear like a Perspex heel, you can obviously unzip. I think this look really cool with like Air Force Jordans. They're just, I love jeans with just like something different. And it's a nice alternative to like the traditional split hem on the side. So I thought these were lovely. I picked these up in a size 10 and they're called the Zip Detail Straight Leg Jean. Okay guys, so as, please excuse the appearance, but I'm filming this a few days later. As I thought, the jeans will not go off, but it's actually, I'm quite gutted because, I mean like, I mean they flattened my ass completely, but the actual like leg of them, I'll put the camera down in a moment looks gorgeous so yeah this isn't going to work but this is the jacket on i was going to get another pair of jeans but i think you guys can gather and um, what the outfit would look like if these jeans fit so i would just recommend like sizing up i think if you've got like big boot and big bum and thick thighs size up twice so i'm a size eight these are a size 10 so i'd have to get a 12 for these to fit but i think if you didn't have like a big bum and um, you're a little bit like slimmer 
then I think just sizing up once would be fine. This is the bomber. I really, really love it. I love the sleeve. It's obviously very oversized. I think if I was to order this again, I wouldn't size up. I would just probably get it in. This is a 10. I would probably get this in like a 6 or an 8. But it is really cute. Like just kind of open like that. I think it is really cute. Um, the top also I absolutely love. I think it's so flattering with like a little bit of side um, boob detailing. Like it's a little bit risky but at the same time like it is just a tank top. If you had a jacket on like no one would know. But I think on a holiday with like some trousers this would be good for like a little skirt with denim shorts. I think it's just a nice like really summer alternative to a classic tank these outfits are very good like a very simple outfit but i think it could be really elevated with like a perspex heel or then if you just throw like jordans or like air force on whatever trainers you like wearing it like dresses it down but you still put like put together to go for lunch to go to the pub to go shopping so yeah and then just throwing a heel obviously just elevates it a little bit so so outfit number two is a little bit for the more warmer nights or the warmer days but nonetheless it is beautiful and i love it when i had my um, misguided unitard in that haul i've just fell back in love with unitards i think they're a really cute but like cool alternative to a typical dress so i picked this like bluey purple colored ribbed one off and i like it because it's got like the little detail under the boobs obviously it's in shorts it's got a little bit on the back i like that it's cap sleeve so like you will feel a little bit warmer um a nice neckline and i thought this would just be really cute i picked this up in a size eight it says it's gray but it's more of like you know like gray with like undertones of purple so yeah i thought this was really cute and then what i paired this with but this does look different than on the website hello babe go on then Doggy daycare. Just me and you, no, Frank? Just me and you. Sasha's gone. So I picked up this jacket. Now, I will put the image here and you can see that it does look different. I thought that this kind of blue wash was more like the colour of this, but it has come and it's just like a sky blue. But I do still love it. Uh, I got it like quite oversized, I think. So this is, I don't know, this is a size 6. I was going to say this looks like, like a 12 okay maybe it said it was oversized which is why i got a six i can't remember i did this order quite a few days ago but it's just like a typical jacket material but it's not on the inside because i feel like that's quite itchy when it's on the inside so it is just like a normal material inside which isn't going to itch it's got tortoise shell detailing on which i like and i'll try this on in the try and clip but i'm thinking i might be able to wear this as a dress and then like just add like white trainers and white socks and i think this could look really cool like with a little blue bag it's got obviously like little bits of orange running through so there's definitely a lot you can do with this but i thought that pairing a unitard with a jacket was a really lovely way of like adding a layer but still feeling like quite cute and summery in a unitard okay so i have put the bodysuit and the unitard on now in the camera i can see my pants but in person i can't brought this to be paired with this jacket but as we thought in the previous clip we didn't think it would go and i don't definitely don't think it will now right let me just put this over my head but i think like a unitard could look really cute with a big oversized leather jacket a big denim shirt or like a jacket of a different color but what i actually realized the other day i was going out for dinner and i tried this on as a dress on its own and it's actually like long enough with just like a little um cycling short i think it would be fine obviously just excuse the unitard underneath but the jacket is definitely cute like paired with like blue jeans and like a bodysuit i think could be really cute um this is how long it is so obviously like the only problem area is this but i think with just a little short you would be pretty safe and I think this just paired with like a crossbody bag and some like high tops, like the Zara sneakers would look really cool and like really, like it's very casual, very comfy, very slate cheap. But obviously you look really cool. So yeah, this is really cute. So I picked up these, I have tried these on and I couldn't get them on, but I tried briefly, so I'll try again. 
I picked up these black jeans. Now, I don't have any black jeans anymore, and I really wanted a pair. So, they're kind of, they're black, but, like, they almost look acid wash on the camera. I don't know, but they're, like, a charcoal grey black. They're not, like, yeah, they're, like, a washed black straight leg jean and then they have this like tie detail at the front which i thought was gorgeous again a really good way of wearing a warm-ish outfit but just having like still those like cool details just thought this was really cute with like heels with trainers because obviously it just adds something to your outfit you don't feel like you're wearing just like a boring jean so yeah these were really cute i will try my best to get these on i picked these up in a size 10 so I am typically a size um a size six. I'm typically a size eight and I always size up in jeans because I can never get them over my bum and my thighs. So I'm just hoping that they fit because I shouldn't have to get a 12. Okay, as I said, these are the exact same. They're just so tight. I did think that I was gonna be able to get them up this time, but definitely not the next thing that i got which i thought would look gorgeous with either pair of jeans but i thought especially with the black was this cropped black blazer now this was part of the disco daydream collection so she's done like a collab with miss pat I, i'd never heard of her but i went on her instagram she looks really cool and she had some like really gorgeous summer pieces but i just thought realistically they're not wearable right now for me anyway this blazer i thought is definitely wearable right now so it is a cropped black leather blazer obviously full length sleeves it's got some shoulder padding which i loved and then it's just got one button here which i thought was really nice so obviously you, this will just make a simple ape it looks so nice like this looks really expensive like zara material it feels really thick i got this in a size eight because i didn't want it to be too big but i thought with the black jeans like even if you just have like the white top on underneath a plain white t-shirt with some boots with some heels i thought this would look really nice so these things obviously aren't what i would like to be wearing but this blazer fits lovely it does have a slight fishy smell but they always do from this part <laughs> my trench coat smelled for a good month but no it doesn't so you do just have to trust the process but yeah this is a really cute outfit like maybe even this was just like a pair of jordans even like double um leather it off wear some leather ottoman leggings some black split hem leggings this could look really cute i love the blazer <laughs> And I also think you could like lay out under this. What size did I get this in? A size eight. So I wouldn't even recommend sizing up. Like I think it has a nice like oversized fit about it regardless. And with, like a little cropped hoodie underneath could look. Like that. Could look really cute. So lastly, I picked up this. Which way? Find it. This I thought this was really cool. So it is called the acid wash high neck extreme 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 crop jumper in grey and i got this in a size eight now it is obviously extremely cropped it's got long sleeved like wide sleeves which i thought was really cute like i like that it doesn't come into a cuff i think it just makes it look really cool and like very like vintage and like i don't know just cool obviously the acid wash too and then we've also got this really nice big collar so even though like this part of you is going to be fairly cold if you just wear like a really high-waisted pair that was my vision like a high-waisted pair of jeans like it's no shorter really than this you could put on like a white or black like crop top underneath and kind of layer up so you've got no like risk of boob coming out but i thought this was really cute like paired with the black jeans and a little black heel some black boots i just thought this was really cute and even like you could throw this on over like a maxi dress so then this is the other outfit that i kind of planned obviously minus the black jeans but we're just ignoring the jean situation because miss papa seriously failed us in that aspect oh do i haven't got any makeup on Okay, so this is the crop sweater. I actually really like it, and I really like it with this um, top because it's got these like thick bands. So I think it like almost looks like it's you know like it goes. I like that it's a high neck, but it's baggy, so it's not gonna like irritate. Definitely gives an extra layer. You definitely need to wear some sort of top, as it doesn't come here. It's here, so yeah. But I do think it's really cool, like with jeans, leather leggings. 
so yeah that is everything that i picked up from miss pat you'll have already seen all the styles tried on so i hope that they looked good and i hope you guys liked them everything will of course be linked below and i always asterisk my favorite pieces so you guys know what i would actually recommend like once i've tried it on and styled it and kind of had more of an insight into the pieces than i have right now so definitely check the description box out for that i hope you guys all really enjoyed this video please give it a big thumbs up if you did and also don't forget to subscribe hope you guys all have a lovely week and i will see you next time bye guys also if anyone wants to know where this top is from it is part of my primark video so definitely go and check that out it will already have gone live so yeah bye guys